And so far, I wonder whether it'll be more Indonesia enjoying the two finals to be decided. Terrific fight back from Addy and Aria there. And uh, well, still got the mixed doubles in the men's singles to come. Mixed doubles first with Praveen Jordan and Debbie Sasanto up against Songyu Choi and Yom Hye Won. to the final from the quarter-final stage. Ravin and Debbie beating the number one seeds uh, yesterday, Koshi Kyung and Kim Hana in straight games, whereas Yom and uh, Sogu into their uh, first final. Took three games to come through the quarter-finals and then straight games against Wang kai Xiang and Wang Dongping in yesterday's semi-finals. very much an established partnership, a fairly new one as far as the Koreans are concerned. The uh, match officials making their way onto court. the Indonesians here to be the favourites up against a fairly fledging pair in their first final but uh, you wouldn't want to predict things today would you really? Sasanto, the first pair out. Sasanto saying that uh, she's wary of the opponents they're facing. Reckons they've got nothing to lose, really. Important about staying focused, staying patient. These uh, pairs did meet a, a few weeks back only. That was at the Japan Open, which uh, was won by the Indonesian pair, this Korean pair, well ranked 80, you can see they haven't really been a partnership that long, started together at the Australian Open, got to the quarterfinals there. Since then, early exits until now, there you can see. One three-gamer en route when 
Shimo Bita, Yuki Kaneko and Shizuku Matsuo in 50 minutes on Friday. Debbie Sasanto and Praveen Jordan. Well, they uh, are ranked number nine in the world. Number three seeds coming in here this week, but they beat the number one seeds yesterday. Lost in the last 16 of their previous three events. But here they are in the final. Chan and Sei of Hong Kong taking them to three games as well on Friday. Just to confirm, David Schwerin and Manit are uh, two in charge. Ready, ready to play. So Pravin Jordan Derby Susanto winning 21-19, 21-18 at the Japan Open. So uh, Choi and Hyom will, uh, will know what to expect here. Played really well yesterday, beating Ko and Kim. They really nullified Ko Shun Kyung. to get it right today as well and you need to say that uh, Ladies they and do they have a great chance of taking the title on my right Choi Soldier, Young Chia Won, Korea and on my left Praveen Jordan and Tabi Susanto, Indonesia Tabi Susanto to serve to Choi Soldier, love all, play. So mixed doubles final. Our fourth of five offerings and uh, wow. Service over. Sloppy One. start, I think, fair love. to say, from Debbie Sosanto, but long match ahead. Together did the uh, Korean pair as a partnership in Australia. Lost in the first round of the Korean Open. Lost obviously in the first round of the Japan Open to to the facing Choi with his power there getting through. Lost in the first round of the Open Chinese Taipei two, but they showed some potential. They took an opening set off Shu Chen Ma Jin in the Indonesia Open, but. That they were going to come here and take the title this week, but they've got a chance. Two, three. Let's have a look at that. Ooh. That was a tight one, wasn't it? Well, 
Well, uh, seven. Two. Now getting into a, a fairly worrisome start as far as Ravid and Debbie are concerned. that you can see why it's put together here on with the experience. Silver medal winner in the World Championships previously and he on the bronze medal winner at the World Juniors. Asian Junior Champion as well, just 20 years of age. Service so over. Three, eight. Starting to find their stride. Clever play from Primary Jordan. Six, eight. for the female partner to try and control that net. So far, is she a young gay one? And a six month break from international competition before she did come back in Australia. And refreshed as well, and maybe about to get back to winning ways, but Ravi uh, Jordan finds another winner. Eight, ten. Choi thought it was going out. Too much to read into the scoreline so far.
play. That's it. Good reactions. Twelve, nine. get hold of it. I mean, you can hear it. I don't know if it's coming across to you watching, but the sound of racket on shuttle when he puts him full body through these. Bang. It's time into the net, though. Serve is over. 13, 11. First final, well, a first chance for a, an open title for Pravin and Debbie. Have been together since the start of 2014. They did win the Southeast Asian Fort Games. Yeah. Fault receiver. 15. Fault 12. Ball against Pravin too Jordan. Too Move too early, says Move the. Too fast. Call from the umpire. Well, not 
nothing she can do to stop that kind of power, is there? Things getting tighter again in this opening game. set now 16 oh. now it's the Indonesian pair in front all about timing your run isn't it yeah. they could be timing it to perfection here Standing there. Service over. 18 all. Yours, partner. Ahead again. 80th in the world in their first final have taken the first game of the final. Young Kirwan and Sogu Choi taking 21 points to 19. Bit of an upset really you have to say.
Well, he should be sitting happy. The hat made, flags out, songs to be sung. Uh, the Korean pair taking that opening game. 20 seconds, 20 seconds. Second game. Well, need to come out fighting here, don't they, Praveen and Debbie? Just got off too, too slow a start in the start of that first game. Serve is over. One. Good reactions at the net and then seeing the point Serve through as well. They've really got to be on their toes. So far they have been at the start of this second game. Talking about the uh, Indonesian pair, of course. They're losing that first set, 21-19. Showed over. how to Three, four. turn a match around after losing the first game. Both receiver. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hey. well. four, four. four receiver called again. It's time. Plates. So it's interesting actually, the uh, Korean coach uh, had a little word with the umpire, didn't he, on the way through, I wonder if it was to say that uh, that's happening pretty often. Just speculating, but it could be. That's just why. So it's over. Five. Oh. That's it. Six, five.
it's a, a handy Eight. lead, isn't it, for Fine. Eon Fine. and Choi here at the start of the second game. Not as big as the lead they had at the start of the first, mind. going out. String there, I'm not surprised. New racket required for Praveen Jordan. Service judge have been Seven. Uh, really Nine. busy on these, haven't they? Action. Uh, apology from Ravi Jordan, but he got himself about the call there really well. For the winner, but prior to that, Serves over ten all. themselves uh, and in front in their attempts to try and claw this one back. 11-10 is only a very tiny lead though, isn't it, for Ravine Jordan and Debbie Sasanto, the world number number nine pet.
Eleven, ten. Play. <laughs> Good rally. Really held back on the power for one shot at least. He's got all that tape on his shoulder, his right shoulder. That's probably Jordan. I'm not sure why it's there because uh, an old bat, but, uh, fantastic from Sogu Choi. Just wide this time. Now it wasn't far away. And stops the little run. Important for the Indonesians here. Now we do see those overheads from Praveen Jordan. Oh, we don't, they don't want to see that though. Service over. 14 12. to level. It was a long way off, wasn't it? about leaving it but it was a good option. Service over 15 14 Santo. Uh, World Championship quarter finalists. The last two years, obviously the only two years they've been together, Praveen and Debbie. I've seen this as a really good opportunity to get a 
Grand Prix gold win under their belts. Losing that first set, set back behind in this second game, set back, but they're digging deep here. from Iom and suddenly it's three game points to take us to a third set again. Praveen Jordan and Debbie Sisanto have done what's required in this second set. No panic from them, was there? Even when they were trading. 21-17, pretty comfortable in the end. And they'll be the favourites, you feel, heading into the decider now. Final game, level, play. So the Thailand Open mixed doubles title comes down to this decisive game. Well, 
that's a pretty decent start to it, isn't it? It's been a, a really good quality start to the second set, hasn't it? Sasanto attacking the uh, backhand of Choi. So far in these uh, finals, uh, we, we've had three finals, two of them gone to three sets, and it's the pair who have been a set down that have taken the second set. They've always gone on to take the third. Of course, uh, one Dong Ping and Lee Kuen Hui managed it in the women's doubles, Wayu and Adi in the men's doubles, and here we are in the mixed doubles. And Ramin Jordan and Debbie Sasanto looking to try and carry that theme through.
hard to get them back every time he launches into them. to say by Choi. Watched it all the way. A very intriguing men's singles match to come after this oh! mixed doubles final. Again a Korean Indonesian Seven, event. Again, <laughs> not, not that time though. He's a bit of a bully, isn't he, really?
Asserting too much authority in it. <laughs> Terrific point, this one. Oh, what a winner at the end. Just instinct. And it takes Choi So Kyu and Young K1 into an interval lead of 11 points to 9. More of the same, please. final point before the interval and they picked up the point after the interval as well so three points the lead now for Troy and Eom. Well. taking four of the five points, but uh, gap cut to three again. Oh. 
the same shot so of stage. Joy. Great winner from Joy. 17, 13, 4 point lead. And we're getting to the closing 13. stages of this match now. These errors are, over. are mounting now, aren't they? Praveen Jordan and Debbie Sassanto. And what an opportunity. We've already seen uh, Scratch Bear take the title in the women's doubles. Well, the Ormans Choi are hardly a Scratch Bear. They've been together for a few events now, but on the verge maybe of a first win. But it, there's still hope. For Debbie and Jordan here. Faint hope, but still hope nonetheless. 
it out. It's match points. Serves over. 20, match point 16. First win together for Ayob Yewan and Choi Sogyu. Another enthralling three game encounter. Just over an hour it took, but uh, fairly emphatic in that final game. Choi Sogyu and Ayob Yewan. 21 16 in the final set of the Thailand Open champions in the mixed doubles. So confirmation. Yong Ye Won and Choi So Gyu coming through. 21-16 in that final game to beat Praveen Jordan and Debbie Sasanto. ครับก็แหมเสียดายครับที่เกมระดับโลกอย่างนี้เนี่ยนะครับนักกีฬาไทยนะครับไม่สามารถเข้ามาสู่รอบชิงชนะเลิศได้นะฮะแต่ไม่
ลำดับต่อไปนะครับขอเรียนเชิญพันเอกทิติพันธ์พุทธบูชาฝ่ายเสประจำผู้บรรบังคับบัญชาเป็นผู้มอบตุ๊กตาหรือมัสคอตให้แก่รองชนะเลิศอันดับหนึ่งและผู้ชนะเลิศขอเรียนเชิญครับถือว่าเป็นของที่ลึกที่น่ารักมากเลยนะครับผม And now I would like to invite Kun Natapat p u p r o m w o n g Chairman of the Far East Speciality Thailand Company Limited, to present the Czech Award to our second place and to our winner. ลำดับสุดท้ายนะครับขอเรียนเชิญคุณนัทพัฒน์ฟูพร้อมวงประธานบริษัท Far East Speciality ประเทศไทยจำกัดเป็นผู้มอบเช็ครางวัลให้แก่นักกีฬาแบดมินตันที่รองชนะเลิศอันดับหนึ่งและก็ผู้ชนะเลิศด้วยครับและ for our photo session it is my greatest honor to once again invite คุณหญิงปัทมาลีสวัตรกูล president of badminton association of Thailand under the royal patronage of His Majesty the King and chairman of the organizing committee in your organizing the CG Thailand Open 2015สุดท้ายนะครับเรียนเชิญคุณหญิงปัทมาลีสวัสดิ์กูลนายกสมาคมแบดมินตันแห่งประเทศไทยในพระบรมราชูปถัมภ์และประธานจัดการแข่งขันแบดมินตันรายการ s c g Thailand Open นะครับเข้าร่วมถ่ายภาพที่ระลึกร่วมกับคุณพันเอกทิติพันธ์พุทธบูชาคุณนัทพัฒน์ฟูพร้อมวงนะครับ We have to thank Kun Yin Patama l i s a w a t r a k u n for organizing the SCG Thailand Open 2015 and making this event so successful. And of course, we have to thank all of our guests of honor, Kun Natapan Phu p r o m w o n g Kun Wan w i m o n and s u p a p r a s a d And of course, เอาละครับนี่ก็เป็นการถ่ายรูปครับสำหรับแชมป์แล้วก็รองแชมป์นะครับถือว่าแม่ตีกันถึงดีกาเลยนะครับ3เกมครับชั่วโมงเสร็จนะถูกต้องครับเป็นคู่ที่โอ้โหทั้งทั้งคนไทยทั้งคนอินโดนีเซียทั้งคนเกาหลีนะครับกรีดการ์ดกันใหญ่เลยเป็นคู่ที่สูสีมากเพราะฉะนั้นนะครับเราได้มาถึงการแข่งขันลำดับสุดท้ายแล้วครับครับเดี๋ยวคู่สุดท้ายครับถือว่าเป็นการเจอกันอีกครั้งหนึ่งนะครับของนักกีฬาอินโดนีเซียกับเกาหลีใต้Okay, so four down, one to go, and it should be a cracker as well. Men's singles time coming up at the Thailand Open. Just the one match so far going through in straight games. I wonder what we got on offer here. Isan Malana Mustafa, the teenager, against the veteran Lee h u n i l Fair to say, one or two have uh, departed, but most of the fans have stuck around for this final offering at the 2015 Thailand Open, and this is how they got to the final. Mustafa beating the number one seed in the quarterfinals, Son Wan Ho of.
Korea. And then.